Man, that's hard. There's so many incredible stories that I love to share. One that comes to mind is a good friend of mine. Her name is Uilani. She's Hawaiian. Uilani Young. And Uilani was 17 years old. She's a high school student. And um, she, at one point of her life, was in a position where she needed help and she needed comfort. And she ended up on Mormon.org because somehow God led her to that. And she found out on Mormon.org two things. Number one, that families could be together forever through being married and sealed through the temple. And the other thing is that uh, the cross wasn't a symbol of our religion, but the lives of the members in following Jesus Christ. And for some reason, those two things touched her so much. And she felt the Spirit so strong that she decided at that time, if someone would just invite her to our church, that she'd be a member for the rest of her life. And it took a, a, another year and a half to to be invited. There was multiple times where she talked to people about the church, but they didn't invite her. And she said every time she was so disappointed and devastated. But on her last day of senior year of high school, she was on the bus. And this kid, Derek Vasquez, sat next to her. And he brought up the church. And he said, you should come to church with me tomorrow. And she said, I would love to come. And she came to church. And then the next day on Monday, we, we took her on a tour of our church building. And that was the first time we met her. And we showed her a painting of the Savior Jesus Christ. And all we said was, Uilani, this is your Savior. He made it possible for you to live with Him and your Father in Heaven forever. All He asks is that we have faith in Him, that we change, that we're baptized, and so He can forgive us of our sins, that we receive the gift of the Holy Ghost to guide us, and that we endure to the end. And she gets this really concerned look on her face, and she looks at myself and my companion, and she says, Is it too late for me to be baptized? And we looked at each other like, Is this for real? And then we said, Ooh, Lonnie, it's never too late to follow the Savior, Jesus Christ. And we invited her then to, to be baptized in three weeks from that day. And we gave her a Book of Mormon, and she uh, read the Book of Mormon in seven days. She was on fire. She knew it was true from the very second she, she walked in. And her mom was completely against the church. And after our second lesson, she told her mom that she was going to get baptized and that she found the truth. And her mom started crying. And Uilani hugged her and said, Mom, I'm so thankful that you care enough about me to, to be crying right now. The only reason why you're crying is because you don't know that this is the way back to God, but as soon as you figure that out, you're going to want to be baptized with me. And her mom says, that that's not the path for me, but I'll support you and let you do what you want. And so after every lesson from then on out, Uilani would take the pamphlet that we taught her from and she'd give it to her mom. She'd give her a little rundown and she'd say, Mom, you need to read this. And it turns out that her mom began being changed without any of us knowing, but we were praying for her and we knew that she'd come to the gospel. And Uilani, her second week as being a non-member, um, we'd been teaching her for two weeks and she went to a broadcast where they announced that Facebook would be would be used in proselyting and she came out of there and she said, Elders, I have a, I have a, a surprise. She said, I, I know something now. And we said, what is it? And she said, I'm going to serve a mission. And we're like, we have only taught you like four lessons and we were so excited, and right now she's in the Missionary Training Center today, actually. She's been there for about a month, and she's going to the Russia Vladivostok Commission, and she's just so excited. But the day she was baptized, um, we took her mom on a tour of the church right after, and her mom came back with with my two of my best friends who were companions in the mission, and they asked Uilani if she could help her mom with something because her mom wanted to know if she'd help her be baptized on the 15th of the next month. And her mom is baptized and Uilani's on a mission and their lives have completely changed all because Uilani was led by God to Mormon.org and knew in her heart that it was true.